All right, recap days 28 to 31. Where are we today? Uh, we are in Copacabana. Country? Oh, we are in Bolivia, finally. Yep. <laughs> Just we... crossed over into Bolivia about 30 minutes ago. Yep. We had a variable cornucopia of smells this morning coming out of uh, coming out of Puno to cross into Bolivia. There was everything from burnt trash to burnt shit to uh, exhaust to urine to you name it. It was really uh, a good send off from Peru, I think. <laughs> All right, so we go back to 28th. So day 28, we were in Cusco. Um, we had the day off. We had the day off, went to see a bunch of museums, um, learned about all the Inca, Mayan ruins that are in Cusco, which of course they consider the center of the universe, like they did with Machu Picchu as well. Mm -hmm. And later on with Lake Titicaca, yep. the Puma Stone, or the Gray Puma. Yep, we did the ride from Cusco to Puno, which, having done that three times now, I can say is still one of the most beautiful rides mm -hmm. in the world. It's just absolutely spectacular. You're at 13,000 plus feet. You have these golden mountains of, of hay, or not hay, but grass. They're, I mean, they just radiate gold and with a little bit of snow caps on some of them and the blues and the sky and everything. I just think it's so crisp and so clean. You're such high altitude. It was just absolutely incredible. Um, and then into Puno, into Puno, which was Puno is meh, but uh, being on Lake Titicaca and going out to the floating islands where the Uros live, that was pretty incredible. Yeah, that was fun. That was a that was a good day. Uh, mm -hmm. See another video that on here for that. We did a little update while we were out there, but it was beautiful and just cool to see how they live and all that. And then uh, today we got up early and got across the border and are now in Bolivia. And check out the view from our hotel. The, uh, yeah, hard to beat, right? Not bad. So we are uh, yeah, just enjoying the last couple of days and taking advantage of what's what's being offered. It's pretty great. So bright. So. We can look the other way. We can switch around. <laughs> so, any, anything else, love? Any, any more really updates? Like nope. What'd you think of, uh, what was your highlight for Cusco? For Cusco, I really enjoyed the town itself. Um, old town, just a tiny little street. Um, the fact that uh, everything was close by, like you literally just walk a little bit and there's another ruin uh, walk a little bit up the hill and there's another outlook and you can see the city and it's just a big city um, lot very westernized definitely a lot of Americans a lot of Germans I caught I caught a bunch of those um, around town but also good food the cleanest place we've been to food since we've clean. been here yep. thankfully like there's been so much uh, trash and, and mm -hmm. pollution and dirt to get to the touristy area they actually keep it really clean so you get to enjoy that at least so yeah anyway all right see you later family <laughs> thanks for checking on us